We already kind of covered there, but I want to get a little bit more detail to show people we're having uh, a little bit of trouble, okay? So, you're going to step out, right? Well, what I'm not going to do is I'm not going to step out completely linearly. I'm also going to angle my back in the direction that I'm stepping, right? So when I step out, she looks like this, okay? And I'm going to bring the left leg in, and I'm also going to come a little bit forward, right? So now I'm going to go left, and the exact same thing. Out, back still point that direction, in, and a little bit forward. Okay? What's going to happen is when you put that together, it's going to have a bit of a walking motion. Right? So I'm going side to side, but I'm also going front and back. Okay? So situate counts is just that. Alright? So 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I got it. Alright, good job. I got it. Okay, so next, we're going to add the arms. So, uh, what you're basically going to do is bring your arm to your chest. Uh, one thing I want to make sure to, to, to point out is you don't want to put your arm in the opposite direction, right? You want your arm moving in the direction that you're stepping. Okay, so, gotcha. you don't want to look like this. You want to look like this, okay? Same thing on the other side, just like that, okay? Just to your chest, but also in the direction that you're stepping, okay? So, let's do two eight counts with the arms, okay? So, five, six, Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So now that you've got the basic step in the arms, to make it just look a little bit nicer, you also want to get just a little bit lower. Right? Oh. You can stay up here if you want. If you want to be cool about it, then you can also get nice and low. And that adds a lot to it. Okay? So let's do two eight counts. Step with the arms, nice and low. So five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so let's do this music. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So what that's going to look like is every third step out, I'm going to fade, right? So we one, two, fade. One, two, fade. Right? I'm just faking and I'm continuing the step, right? So with the arms and everything, it'll look like this. One, two, fade. One, two, fade. Okay? You can kind of play with it. You can really kind of improve it out, okay? So let's try two big counts with the double. Okay, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right? If you're wondering what I'm doing with my arms, I'm just reversing what I just did, right? So if I'm stepping this way with the jab step, you am gonna reverse it and then continue. Right? So boom, continue. Right? Okay. So let's try all of that with music. The bugs and all the ladies try to steal it. Now you just do you and I'm gonna do it. the double, uh, we're going to play around with some arm variations, alright, so this will help add a little bit more spice, uh, if you're still uncomfortable with the first part, just keep moving back, get, get comfortable there, uh, and then move on to the arm variations, okay, so the first one we're going to do uh, is just a hair brush, so instead of just right to the chest, you're going to come up to your head, right, so this has, you need to add a little bit more kind of, uh, I'm not sure what term to use, I don't know if swag is outdated, but that's really what it is, right, you have to kind of feel it, because this move is more about Alright, so hairbrush. Uh, second variation is just arms out to the side. Now this is deceivingly difficult because your arms aren't doing anything, you've got to really rely on your shoulders, right, to add that group. So just arms out to the side, a double step, just really activate the shoulders and move it that way. Okay? Second or third one is just an arm flow. And you can kind of toss it in wherever you want. You can toss it on the third step out. I wouldn't overthink it. Just try it and play with it, correct? Right? You can really add it in any part of the set, at any speed, as long as it feels right, okay? So just kind of toss it in. All right, last variation, the drum 
dog walk. I don't know if it's called the dog walk. Dog walk. Just when you lower your fist and kind of turn it, right? Yeah. This again, you gotta have a lot of quote unquote swag. I know it's outdated, but basically what you're doing is just kind of moving and looking at your fist. Alright, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. If you guys want more, definitely subscribe and that bell notification. Alright, man. I think I got it. Uh, if there's anything you want me to talk about, maybe something you saw on my TikTok, uh, just drop it. Teach me how to do it. I think I got it. Teach me how to do the instrumental. Getting that from YouTube. Marketing and creative decisions can be hard, but maximizing marketing. With my Phillips Latte Go, it's always a good time for a coffee. I know I'm a mess with this Dougie now. Or during afternoon break. I start with freshly ground beans. I'm asking it so much, I'm going to do it on this table. And it didn't take me long. the first time I watched this video. The first time I watched this video, so I want to do this Dougie on this table. It's clean in just a few seconds. That's it, man. That's it, bro. I nailed it. I'm gone.